We're back in Remnant 2, and we're excited to share a first look at one of the brand new bosses in the upcoming DLC, The Awakened King. We've been playing the game for a few days now, and I cannot wait to share more and dive into some guides, builds, and of course, secrets. Today, however, we have the special privilege of revealing the Sunken Witch, one of three bosses coming in the DLC, and a really interesting fight that forces players to maneuver in an extremely tight encounter area against a melee heavy enemy that chains together combinations of attacks giving you little room for error. There's also a fun intermission phase where you'll have to contend with a pack of pig dogs, so yeah, it's a good time. You're also getting a quick glimpse at one of the new zones in the game, the Sunken Haunt, which continues to build upon the Dran world established in the base game. We will step through the fog door together and get our first introduction to the Sunken Witch, and we'll see you on the other side of the cinematic for some commentary on the action. Right off the bat, you can see that the Sunken Witch is wielding a massive anchor weapon that she drags around before unleashing a chain of attacks. You'll have to keep your head on a swivel during the entire fight as the encounter area often forces you to roll behind the boss, requiring you to whip your camera around to keep track of the witch's movement. Her attacks are often chained together in a series of animations, and there are a few nasty combinations in there that can really catch you off guard, especially the ones where slightly delayed timing might throw off your internal rhythm. Luckily, because the boss is using a heavy weapon, there is a small window of opportunity at the end of each string of attacks, allowing you precious seconds to get some offense in. Throughout the fight, the boss will use her hook to escape the encounter area and send down a pack of dogs to clog up the arena. You'll have to immediately deal with them as they can absolutely cause havoc, and if left unchecked, the boss plus dogs makes for a really bad combination. The Sunken Witch's special attack is a whirlwind type ability that will force you to constantly dodge away for a few seconds and is easily the toughest mechanic in the fight to deal with. Her weak spot, as you can see here, is the head, and please don't roast us in the comments, this is not legacy gameplay, this was provided by the publishers because clearly we would never get hit and every shot would have been perfect if it was our gameplay. I kid. Overall, it's a fun, straightforward fight that will hopefully get you back in the Remnant 2 group as you get your bearings in the new Awakened King DLC. We'll let the rest of the fight play out and leave you with a peek at the crafting material you get as a reward for killing the boss. Sadly, we cannot share any more details about that item at this time, so it'll be up to your imagination to fill in the gaps. Remnant 2's first DLC, The Awakened King, is available starting November 14th, 2023 for all major platforms and will cost around 10 bucks if you didn't already purchase the ultimate edition of the game. My name is Kodiak, and from everyone here at Legacy Gaming, thanks for watching, and play on. I can't believe I killed that thing. Whew.